Hi, my name is Kaylee Loyon, and I am a senior at Mississippi State University, majoring in animal and dairy science with a pre-veterinarian concentration. I grew up riding and owning horses that were trained for pole bending and barrel racing, but I've always wanted to extend my knowledge on equine and learn how equine facilities operate. Over the 2022 spring semester, I decided to invest time interning at the horse unit at Mississippi State that is also part of the Henry H. Levick Research Center located on South Farm. Throughout my internship, it has granted me with experience with horses and knowledge to as how much maintenance and care is needed for the equine species. A typical daily routine consists of checking the board that will consist of chores as to like cleaning and feeding along with other jobs like stripping down stalls or bringing therapy horses into the catch pens when they are needed. After checking the board, I begin to feed hay to all the horses and start prepping their feed as according to the board. Some horses receive specific feeds, supplements, or medications in the morning and in the afternoons. It is important to make sure that each horse receives their specific needs so that way it isn't forgotten. After feeding all the horses in the barn, we prepare feed for all the horses out in the pastures and use the trucker side by side to feed. Feeding the outside horses isn't as easy as you may think. It is our responsibility to make sure each horse receives their specific medications, checking to see if anyone is missing shoes, and checking to make sure each horse is maintaining a good body condition. Along with also checking hay bales, water troughs, and any unsafe fencing or conditions. Once the outside horses are all fed, we go back to the barn and turn out the barn horses into their pastures if the weather permits us. After turning out the barn horses, we begin cleaning the barn horses stalls using a rake and red buckets. Once we are finished cleaning stalls, we dump all the buckets into the tractor and it is deposited into the manure pile. Water buckets will be refilled and the barn is cleaned up before the morning routine is done. In the afternoon, chores are very similar to in the morning as well as feeding and cleaning stalls if necessary. Some of the other tasks I was responsible for was observing Sonny when he finally got castrated and observing the farrier trim Sweet Pea's hoof in which she has a stifle injury. I've been able to use previous knowledge learned from my classes as an ADS student, including animal nutrition, anatomy and physiology, and companion animal nutrition. They all help contribute to understanding maintenance and it made feeding regimens easier to follow. Over my internship at the horse unit, it has taught me many new skills from learning each horse's personality to be able to being able to go on foal watch for mares that are close to foaling, while also getting to interact with the new foals and start to form a bond with them have been some of my greatest accomplishments. I also picked up a new friend, the barn cat Nick, while working at the horse unit. Learning and understanding everything that I have learned at the horse unit will allow me to use and utilize the skills to continue my path of becoming a veterinarian student and a soon a certified veterinarian. With learning so much from my experience, I recommend it to anyone who is interested in working with horses, as it to be for their career or for just experience. Thank you.